broke back into France. We are Nikki and Gert, a couple from tiny Belgium wanting to explore Europe and beyond. We converted our own camper van, Nigel. And together with our cats Nala and Sihi, we left on our big adventure. Together, we are Euronauts. We are now very close to the city of Narbonne in France. As you can see, we're back between vineyards. But unfortunately, it's only open on uh, Saturday, Sunday, and Wednesday. Just have to look at it from a distance, I guess. In a van. So we're on a morning hike and uh, suddenly we have a dog. It's too big, so we can't keep it. It's from uh, our neighbors from this night and uh, they're nowhere, probably still in their van. So, okay then. Nikki adopted it already. Yeah. For breakfast. We still have a dog. Still have a dog. I'm doing that step. It's not my dog. 
we left our camping spot and we are currently uh, driving the direction of Clermont Ferrand. So we just stopped uh, just to take a break and we noticed that air was escaping from the tire. Apparently the rubber is tired and uh, or did pff, I don't know what we have to we have to fix this somehow. Okay, so I glued super glued. Get to fixing the shit you out of this. You see here where the, the tear is. Um, so we're gonna reinflate reinflate the tire and hopefully stay. So the tire is still leaking, so no pictures of the bridge and we're gonna drive to a tire shop very quickly. We arrived at the tire shop where they're gonna help us. So luckily it's just the valve, so just replace the valve and then hopefully that fixes the problem. We successfully made it to Isoir. We did a uh, small, small city near Clermont-Ferrand. And now we're gonna just uh, have a little stroll, see if we can find a nice restaurant for this evening. Isoir, not too much to see here. Just the average French village down right back to Nigel and it seems that we arrived just in time it's full now we had a nice dinner here for our three-year anniversary in Isoir in um, Bistro Le Globe and uh, I must say uh, it was very good it was very good good food decent prices and the service is excellent. absolutely excellent. Yes. Very friendly people. If you ever pass through here, I would recommend to go and have uh, have some food there. Yeah. We had a, a nice night of sleep. Uh, right now, we're going to the local market here in Isoir before uh, we continue our journey into the cold. It already is cold. After a lovely morning uh, on the market, uh, we had some breakfast, some coffee, and now we're ready to hit the road again and going further in our journey back to Belgium. Anyway, I just flew the drone over this uh, yeah, medieval town and uh, we'll see it later. But tomorrow we're gonna walk all the way to the other side or maybe later this evening, we'll see. But, uh, it's quite nice. We are having a little city.
morning, boys and girls. It's a pretty cold night. You can even see where the insulation of the van is. Luckily, we have diesel heating, so no worries. It's quite misty. The smell of uh, burned wood. We went from zero to winter in one week. So, toilet clean, and we're gonna leave a little donation for the for the children. How do I do this? Okay. There we go. Apparently it's for the children. That's what it says in the toilet. Well, let's go. in a small village called Roqua in the French Ardennes. It's probably gonna be our last stop for this trip. It seems there was some kind of event here today, some cycling event, I think mountain biking. So, old fortified city. It was very small, we just drove through the city center to get here. It was all uh, because of the event we couldn't pass through, but I saw there was a uh, an old timer event. I'm gonna take a look. Seems to be all Opel GTs here. All of them. Ready for our last drive to the cold Belgium. We arrived yesterday evening um, at my grandma's and my parents, and now it's time to leave our home on wheels and go to Antwerp with uh, my grandmother's car because it's much smaller and yeah, Nigel cannot enter the city because there is a low emissions zone and it doesn't meet the standards Today we're gonna install the water heater here it is, it arrived here a few days after we left, 